So next I'm going to show you installation of the wiper arm. Now first of all, if we're not using these extra aux electrode sockets, we need to plug them up with these plugs. This is to allow no water to get inside and damage the electronics. These all need to be tightened up again with the lanyard as tight as possible to allow no water to get inside the probe. Next we need to install the wiper onto the onto the arm. First of all, the brush needs to be installed into the end like so. And the longer wiper needs to be installed into the wiper arm like so. These are then fitted together with the brush facing down. into the wiper arm like that. And this can then be fitted. This brush lines up with this socket. This is then fitted into the end of the AP7000 and the pin installed like so. Now before we use the wiper arm we must make sure that there's a free flow around so that the wiper arm doesn't get jammed so we need to carefully remove the pH cap. Now yours might look like this or it might have come like this. Carefully remove the cap to expose the combi electrode terminals. We can now check whether the wiper arm is cleaning properly by turning on the meter If we go to menu and clean probe on the meter, then we will see that it is cleaning all of the terminals. And as we have assigned AUX1 and AUX2, it is also cleaning these sockets, but not the ones that we haven't assigned.